Ow! Dude, I just fucking, literally, I just went like this, and my hair just, like, did some shit. I feel like I'm Jaden. Okay, okay, so I'm at the Gay Boy Cardi concert. I love Playboy Cardi. He got the first self-titled shirt on. Literally, bro, I went to, like, Playboy Cardi three years ago. Y'all can't oh, drip the fuck out. Oh, God. We on X. We on code, man. Look, bro, I was just Yo, at his bro, concert, bro. Hey, oh, God, yes, bro. It's him. Yeah, it's their first concert. They don't know what they in for, bro, because we're going to be, I'm literally going to catch a body in this bitch, bro. Seats or floor? Oh, uh, hell no. You gay. The bitches that listen to Playboy Cardi, they be bad. Some of them be ugly, though. But I'm trying to find some, like, bad hoes. It's mostly dudes out here. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, yeah. That's the fact nigga CD. Fire ain't no niggas still give CDs. Oh, God, bro. Real CD that bitch? Yeah, it's real. I haven't been making videos in a minute, but I'm going to start making videos, like, all the fucking time now. This concert is going to be my medicine, okay? I'm going to let all my frustration out through this concert. How you think I feel, nigga? I've been in the crib for 10 days with COVID, and now I'm out this bitch. Pit, bro? Yes, bro, you gotta jump down. Oh, Look, down bro, shit, this bro. stupid yeah. ass, this motherfucker, talking about some. I'm a rage. I'm a rage. I'm gonna kill somebody, bro. I'm finna. I'm finna. A, NBA young boy, you know what I'm saying? But he got seats, bro. He not even in the that pit. Sold out, bro. You came with a girl, bro. I mean, it's your girl. It's your girl. Yeah, you didn't see. Yeah, exactly, exactly, exactly. No, I don't want to get out the way. I'm a narcissist. I only care about myself, bitch. All right, I'm finna go rage, bro, and go fucking try and. Fuck a girl or some shit in the concert. We literally told them that we were hanging out today. Like literally, I forgot. And but you forgot, guys. Camera on camera action right now. I'm with the gas station man. Well, he looks so lost. Oh, 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 ladies hit him up, dude. One part where I say my blunt like a pig, you can't really hear me say blunt. I just like, bro, I like changing people's like, I don't know, I like switching the flow hella, but it's cool, I don't know. Yeah, but it's good to have the same flow in the two bars. Yeah, true. Motherfuckers with ADHD, I feel like they're the they most be creative. Smart. Yeah, they be smart, smart as fuck. It just comes out. Like, maybe not the best at school, but like, actually thinking and shit. Yeah. Like, we have like the biggest brains and shit. Literally the ADHD kids who are famous, like. Who I was are, just finna say that, bro. No cap, bro. Cause like, they mind constantly going, like exactly. just constantly got them. And it's so open, bro. It's so like always new, different things happening. Okay, guys. So I'm at the gas station. I just washed my car. I just been going through shit recently. You know. I just want to tell everybody the reason why I've been going through shit is because I'm coming out as gay. <laughs> I'm just playing. No. So basically, what happened? You know, I met a female, a great person. Shit didn't go, you know, the way I wanted it to go. I caught feelings. You feel me? And it knocked me off my grind. So, I can't even talk about this right, guys. I'm gonna leave this in here because, like, this is literally hard for me to talk about. And I'm, as a YouTuber, 
I feel like I have to be able to, you know, express myself to y'all. You know, I don't post a lot on Instagram. I never was the one to post my feelings on the social media or anything. But, you know, YouTube, you guys actually care about me. You know, the people who watch this shit, they're watching because, you know, they like Wolf's at. And I appreciate everybody who fucking watches me. It's only right for me to be real with everybody, you know. So recently in life, I couldn't make my mind up, you know, because I was like, fuck, do I like this girl? Do I like YouTube? Do I like other shit? You know, you know me, like, I'm just really indecisive right now. I couldn't make my mind up, you know, and I feel really bad because I don't want to put anybody through shit because of me. I know I got to find myself right now. I got to work on myself. And I was having doubts on YouTube. Like, it really destroyed me. Honestly, I was heartbroken because, you know, when you're sad, you're sad and you just think the worst. When I was sad and shit, it just knocked me off my grind. Like, I wasn't here. I just felt bad, you know, just every day. So I was just like, fuck, like, I don't even want to do nothing. So basically, I was just down. You feel me? I was down bad. That, that's all I can really say. That happened, right? And on top of that, other, I just L after L after L. Something happens with my car. Not my fault. Not even my friend's fault. But that shit happens. Some shit in my family family happens L some shit with my one of my best friends happened L after L after L it's just like life has been hitting me like really fucking hard lately I'm just gonna be straight up I'm happy now I'm getting better and I'm fixing myself right now I want to actually be a good person like I don't want to just say these things and do nothing about it like I want to actually show the progression I want to show like I want to show that I'm really about what I'm saying about you're gonna see in my videos you're gonna see a, me as a person fucking grow from this it's gonna be up from here the support that I get from you guys is just insane like I know it's not even a lot of you but the majority of you who actually watch me watch me and I like I can't explain how grateful I am for that people telling me yo I binge watch your shit I binge watch your shit da, 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 da. like I have people I don't even know come up to me and like yo you're the dude that does videos I've seen you on Instagram I've seen you Da, 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 da. and that shit really like touches me i'm like damn i can really do this shit you feel me like and it really gets my mind going back to like damn zach like what are you doing like don't give up on this shit i get discouraged because i'm like damn maybe my shit's not funny enough maybe i'm not entertaining the shit i do is repetitive if i just put that shit to a side and really just focus and grind and fucking do this shit it'll come with time everything will heal with time everything will come with time time is the best thing in life really because it can either make or break you and it teaches you things and it fucking shows you things it gives you things everything so really just let time do its thing for real if you're going through anything right now there's not only one person out there for you if you feel like there's only one person there's only one girl only one boy whatever that's not the case like they just haven't came yet if it didn't work out then it just didn't work out you feel me like you got to get over the shit so of course you're gonna be sad you feel me like everybody be sad Okay, so, alright, maybe that wasn't the best place to, um, you know, record a video at, you feel me? It's a lot of personal shit that's been happening to me, and it hasn't been great. And I just want to let you guys know that I'm bouncing back from it. I know in the past I have said, like, damn, I'm really going to do this shit, I'm going to bounce back. But this time I'm really, for real, like, every time I have said I was bouncing back, did I not? I posted a video every single week when I said I was. I got my quality, I got my content going up and up and up. So I have been about my word every time I said I've been about it. The reason why this time is a little different is because I had shit going on, you know? And people have shit going on. It's not gonna be the only time I have shit going on. But now I know, never trust the bitch, ever. You feel me? And I'm not just saying, I, like, this has nothing to do with the girl that, you know, I was fucking with. I know I'm childish, and you know I'm childish, but I ain't gonna be that childish. I'm working on myself. So hopefully you see the better in me, you know. Life hurts. Life is not fair. It is not pretty. Sometimes it is. Life is beautiful, but it's not pretty, if that makes sense. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yo, Jersey Boy, nigga. Yo, here's the Yo, Jersey Boy, dot MTME on Instagram, my nigga. Got a single out everywhere featuring Trophy Lanes. Make sure you go fucking cop that. You fucking cop that. Kiss the motherfucking ring, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> the most random shit always happens, literally. Fuck, y'all got cameras going and shit. Motherfuckers getting beat up. The cash register just almost got jumped. Listen, every time I come anywhere with Mason, random shit, random shit always is happening. <laughs> hey, y'all be good, man. I'm out of here, man. Hell yeah, we too. Hold it down, man. Dude, I wish you could have recorded that. Oh my god. <laughs>
I didn't even finish talking. So much shit happened. We ran into Star's dad. Y'all know Star. I don't even remember where I left off at. All I know is I'm young. I just turned 20. Pussy. I've been chasing pussy. If you want the full honesty, I've been chasing pussy. I have been talking to girl after girl after girl. You know, I thought I even found my soulmate. When I was talking to her, I wasn't talking to other girls. But after that, I just been chasing pussy. Like, literally, just left and right, left and right, left and right. And I just lost focus so now i just need to gain focus back on what i really need to do if you out there chasing pussy right now look at yourself in the mirror get in the shower without music i know that's hard because i don't like getting in the shower without music either and just be like damn okay how many bitches have i fucked this week how many girls have i texted in my phone a lot what have i done that's productive besides fuck a bitch or talk to a girl nothing very little so flip the rules get back on your grind and do what you need to do because pussy you can get that forever there are so many bitches out here but time and your dreams and your goals and shit that you need to work on that shit is not forever like of course yeah shit takes time to do things but i need to be working on this youtube shit right now life isn't about pussy at all it's about growing it's about fucking being a better you getting your goals getting your dreams met and that's what i'm doing now so i want a girlfriend and I would treat a girl right, you know? I'm loyal as fuck in a relationship. I'm gonna treat you like my princess, honestly, if you're my girlfriend. And I'm gonna take you serious, all this shit, do everything for you. But, I just haven't seen a girl show me that she's worth that. Until then, I'll just keep doing what I do. I just stick to myself, you know? I don't chase girls, I don't go after them. Unless I really like them. I've only done that like two times in my life. I'm just being completely honest. Like this video probably boring as fuck to y'all because y'all are like, damn, like I don't want to hear this man talk about this shit. But I'm just telling y'all, bro, because or this is literally why I have not been filming. So like I'm just laying out the truth. Like, would you rather me lie and be a fake motherfucker? Or would you rather me be how I've always been and be myself on the fucking camera? Like I'm always myself on this damn camera. The way I am on the camera is the way I am in real life. The shit I was telling myself like, oh, YouTube, I'm not gonna be nothing at it i'm probably not funny enough it's too hard oh, fuck that shit nothing's too hard anything hard is worth it love all my friends around me all my friends my group great fucking people like literally they support me they believe in me just find you a group of friends that actually have your back don't be friends with somebody because you feel like that's your only friend like shit i'd rather be alone than fucking have some fake ass friends like friends that's gonna laugh at you because you don't have what they have like fuck that you gotta have what you want Fuck having what everybody else has. Be yourself. That's why most happy people are different. They're not like other fucking people. You know why? Because they're not scared to be however the fuck they want to be. And I believe in anybody. Everybody has some kind of talent they just don't know about. Like, I don't care how big I am. I'm not going to ever belittle anybody just because I feel like I'm bigger. I'm not going to let that shit get to my head. And if I do, somebody needs to slap the shit out of me because <laughs> I'm not ever going to get to that point. Like, I'm not better than anybody. Who cares what anybody's thinking? If you're sad right now, bro, feel that shit out. Time will heal it. Even as hard as you try to be happy or try to get over shit, that shit will take time to get over. You don't just get over that shit easily. You'll get through that shit for real. Like, whatever it is, you really will get through it. Believe in God, that's what I do. I don't know if y'all are religious, but I am. I love God. I believe in God. He helped me through everything. So, right now, I'm loving life. Hell yeah. I love literally every single one of you. And love is a strong word. I love every one of you that watch me. Letting y'all know, really, what's up with me. Thank you, for real.